Hi guys, welcome back on my channel, Dorota Palicka International, nail artist and educator here, and today we are going to play with some glitter and a butterfly shape. How about we preview of it in here? Yeah, I have added some golds and a rose gold, uh, and actually I quite like it, those color combination. Uh, I hope you will really enjoy watching this tutorial. If you're new in here, don't forget to subscribe us. There is lots of tutorials coming up every Monday, Wednesdays and Saturdays. Sometimes if you've got an extra time, we try to produce even more videos for you. And also thank you so much guys to all your existing sub subscribers who are here with me for such a long time. Let's start. <laughs> So I've got those cute butterflies and they're really awesome, they come in all different colors. Um, I can also get the separate colors as well and I thought I will use those two. I quite like them for the autumn colors. Um, so I'm just picking up those two colors and uh, they're really nice. I actually take them out, a couple of them. You can see it guys. Uh, they holographic. So they sparkle into... Oh, that's so beautiful in a camera. Wow, really beautiful. So I have took a couple out and I've got some peachy, I would say. It's not pink, it's not, I would say it's a kind of peachy uh, or salmon color and the other ones are gold. Uh, so we are going to do also some rose gold, uh, just to match those, so rose gold and a gold transfer foil. And very popular design at the moment, that's some waves. So I'm going to use the transfer foil uh, gel glue, uh, which is fantastic uh, for adhering a transfer foil. So I'm just putting a drop of it on my mixing palette and we'll start painting those uh, wavy design. So I have just picked up a scoop of it and then quickly do couple waves. And um, this part might be not really visible on the camera because I'm painting obviously with the clear gel. Um, but what I'm doing is I'm just, uh, I would call it almost letter S. So it's a almost letter S I'm painting. And try to uh, distribute the gel kind of nice and even uh, so the foil sticks in nice and even. And then one more there. Uh, if you find it difficult, I would advise you do uh, one color first of the transfer foil and then second color. But I have painted those waves and I'm going to cure it 30 seconds. Okay, same on this one here. We are not going to do the butterflies. No, so let's do the one with the butterfly first. Actually, I will color this one more, why not? So this one is going to be slightly different. I will apply the foil more at the free edge and around the cuticle area. But still in those wavy motion. And then cook it 30 seconds as well. So I'm going to cut a piece of those rose gold foil. And we've got the Actually, all the products we've got available on our uh, website. You can check the links out in the description of the video. But the rose gold, I think, is a must-have. Those transfer foil is absolutely amazing. Now, let's don't overcook my thumb. So, I'm going to apply those gold one here on the top.
and this gel takes the transfer foil really really well as you can see it is already coming off nicely transferred and then the rose gold so I started with the gold because it's easier it's on the edges and now I'm going to apply the rose gold basically all you have to do it is you can see it is already already there just massage it a little bit and then peel it or do it like on waxing technique so whichever you find it uh, easier okay and then I'm going to do the rose gold here doing so on the um, on the tips is more difficult because they are moving uh, but working on the clients is so nice and easy So I just took it off from the holder so I can have more control over it. That's easier <laughs> and quicker, much quicker guys, I'm telling you. Okay, now here I want to add also those gold. So I'm just putting another drop quickly. So another drop. And then we are going to paint the gold. I mean, transfer foil gel first. And same in here. Then cook it. Now I've got a time to apply some butterflies. So for the butterflies application, normally I would encapsulate them on the client uh, first, uh, but you can also encapsulate it in a base gel. So I'm picking up a drop of the base gel, some old brush, and just put those base gel and then start picking the butterflies. And they go so well with this uh, transfer foils, like really, really nice. So I'm applying them in the middle part. Don't go too close to the edges because uh, uh, they are like a chunky glitter so you don't want to have them too close to the edges one more and then that looks pretty <laughs> give it a cure okay so this part is ready for a gold foil just don't move the tip tip don't move stay there okay and then a same drop of the base gel and a couple of those butterflies Like lots of my clients uh, goes for those wavy look. Uh, they really like it, this trend, because it's not over the top. But I wanted to do it it's slightly different. So not just with the gel polish, but also with the transfer foil. And a cute butterflies. But still in a... Kind of all to me colors. I 
and then flash cure it. So after we have flash cured, what else, if you find them like from the side that they are sticking out quite a lot, you could just apply another layer of the base gel. Um, I'm going to straight with the top coat, but I'm going to apply a really decent amount of the top coat over it. So a decent amount of the top coat. And then cook it. Then this nail is going to be uh, simple, we will just apply some transfer foil in there. And then on this one we are going to do some waves, so I'm just picking up another scoop of the um, uh, transfer foil gel glue and we are going to paint a couple waves. So on top of the white and clear is hardly visible. I hope guys you can see it. I'm just painting like a wee wave in here. Making sure I distribute the product pretty even. And another wave. As I have said, you could uh, do one color first and then do a second color. I'm going to try to do two colors at the same time. Okay, cook it 30 seconds. And let's check the other nails and also what we have created. So we've got wing finger here. Then the thumb. That's so autumn colors, like, and so sparkly. I love how they blink, blink. <laughs> right, okay, let's transfer this one quickly. So I'm just going to cut another piece of the gold foil. And the rose gold one. And I'm going to keep this one so I can safely transfer this one here. And it was just because I didn't want the uh, gold to go on the other places. Now I can remove the rose gold. I hope I don't make you guys confused. That's so pretty. Uh, not over the top. And now this one is going to be hard. I moved the tip, so when I press it's not going to pull it. And then take it off as well. So that's just very simple wavy ones. And the top coat, just to seal the design. and cook it. So not over the top, pretty quick I would say uh, design, uh, but I love, I love really how those uh, colors goes together and the fact like how sparkly those butterflies are. I love it, like so addicted to it, that's so pretty. Oh this is crazy. And I show you the gold ones as well. I love how the uh, new stuff looks in the zoom in camera. Wow.
so pretty. How satisfying it is, guys. <laughs> so red, I like, I really love those kind of looks. Oh, wow. Because sometimes you cannot see it, how pretty the things are uh, until you see them so close. But anyway, that's this uh, finger finished as well, the nail. And it can go in here. I hope you have enjoyed it, watching this uh, rose gold and gold tutorial. And I'm sending you lots of glittery hugs and bye.